Hey everyone, it's Ben from Mercer Lab here with a new board from LipTech. This is the Hydro Snapper. This is the 5.4 version. And this is um, one of their wake surf boards. So this board um, was designed for wake surfing. It doesn't have a leash plug in it, so keep that in mind. Um, if you want a leash plug, you either have to install one yourself or get one of the stick-on ones. Um, but even though it's designed for wake surfing, it works uh, really well for river surfing as well. Um, I just picked up this board recently. Um, the river and the snowpack here in, in Denver has been pretty weird this season. It's been an average snowpack year, but we haven't gotten a lot of flow through River Run Park. Um, but we, we have had a decent number of days kind of at um, kind of this barely surfable flow. It's surfable and fun, but not as good as it can get. And I was surfing my Catch Surf 54 Special, and it was fun, but I was getting a little bit tired of it. And so I stopped by Evo in Denver, and they had one of these on their rack. They actually have a lot of wake surfboards there in stock. Um, not necessarily a lot of river surfboards, but a lot of wake surfboards. And so I, I saw this one and I, I grabbed it because I kind of liked the shape. I had been wanting to try another um, wake surf shape since I had um, several years ago tried the Aaron from LibTech as well. Um, and I didn't like that, but this one is a little bit different shape, a little bit more hold and tail compared to the Aaron. So I thought I'd give this one a try. And I've been enjoying it at kind of the low waters at, um, at River Run Park. Uh, with LibTech, super durable, and I've banged it off the bottom there a bunch of times already. No sign of damage, which is perfect for kind of that, that low water there. Um, comes as a thruster. I've been running it with um, two medium um, side bites and a small trailer. Um, and it's been working really well. I've been able to um, throw buckets with it as well as spin it. Um, and this has all just been kind of at this lower water level around 150 CFS. Um, I haven't gotten to surf it yet at kind of higher water at River Run Park or surf it anywhere else, honestly. Um, so I'm probably not going to be able to do a review on it this season, but next season I'll bring this around with me and try to surf it, you know, Boise Bend. Um, I might try to take another um, Lake Chelan trip um, and I'll definitely bring this as well. A board like this will definitely travel really well on the plane and I think it might be really, um, it might work really well on that city wave up there. Um, so I'm excited to try it there. So uh, if you're looking at some of the wake surf shape from LibTech and you want it for river surfing, I definitely recommend checking this board out. Um, I've enjoyed it so far. I can't really speak to it on any other waves other than River Run Park and Low Water, but um, look for a review of, of this board after I surf it on a bunch of other waves, probably sometime next season. Um, yeah, check this board out. Pretty cool shape. Pretty cool graphics. I'm digging it so far. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.